The vision for America is one word. Network. Network. Sometimes it seems that America is walking in some kind of mental fog. Some think that walking in fog is walking by faith. Walking by faith in leadership with accurate vision and accurate thinking is a whole new level of faith. Let's look at the real world for a second. There are 3,007 counties in America. Every county is under major attack spiritually, financially, families under attack, schools under attack, churches under attack, health care under attack, you name it, it's happening. Right? Now we're not just making this up, are we? No, it's a fact, and it's time to take care of business here. It is under attack, and therefore it is a problem, and every problem carries a solution. And it's definitely our business. Business is your highest spiritual understanding demonstrated. Now here's a solution that's always worked. To have people in one county who sit together, brainstorm together, are totally committed to an outcome, and that committed outcome is, for me and my household, we will serve the Lord. We will have freedom, and we will have liberty in Christ. We're not going to let Washington, D.C., nor some bureaucrat tell us what to do. We are going to live by a simple contract with government, and that contract is stay out of our business. Our network has had that contract with government, with the county, with the city, with the state, with the federal government, for over 50 years. That's the contract at your leadership table. The right people understand the value and recognize the power of that table, enforcing that contract, so the families represented at that table know they have a life that's not going to be run over like a freight train by government or by people pretending to be government, people who have infiltrated our government, trying to take it over from the inside. People at that leadership table will be trained and will have control of their own finances. Number one, it's a no problem zone at that table. Number two, with financial control. That's the picture. That's the vision. That table represents a no problem zone that the network is here to enforce and that is what they're the best at, the very best in the world. That's why we're number one. Not everyone will fit. Not everybody in that category of thinking and acting and believing. But we believe that we have enough people in or around each and every county that we can put non-debt financing in place to support and operate the right network interest in that county completely debt free specifically for agriculture but for some businesses too and if they don't folks we've lost it our grandchildren have no chance if we don't do this and do it the right way right now it's not a fear mode we don't fear it we just recognize it that this is the path this is like a railroad track set in concrete unmovable unshakable this is not like a big open parking lot where you can turn circle eights in the snow. This is a laid down straight and true path and they lead right over to the horizon where we all have to go. We have to put in remote control. Two words that we consider absolutely essential. Remote control. And we have to absolutely have remote control in place where you can totally remote control your own personal and business and professional finances. Debt free where you, by training and technology, have the control. You, not some big building downtown. Control, where you can access and control everything you need to live on, to do what you need to do to help people with, to do your networking, everything, by your own remote control under sacred contracts, getting back to what made America great and powerful. We have technology for that remote control, which is way beyond anything you've ever seen in the financial world. If you saw the technology and professionals we have in place to protect and enforce the no problem zone, folks, it even blows my mind. And I'm a pretty big thinker. People who are going to do anything worthwhile in this real world will absolutely have to be in the driver's seat of everything around them. They've got to have environmental control and be in charge of change in their environments so those environments support them, work for them, and not against them. What we want you to do is to know that you have authority. When you talk to people, we want you to speak from authority. But don't think that you have to clear the fog for them. Don't let them control what you say. First, you see what they're made of, how their brain works, how committed they are to doing what's right for this country and for their family. 
See how committed they are to understanding credibility, which is the line between right and wrong, the line between what works and what doesn't work. That's credibility, that line. See how committed they are to things that are valuable, to their belief about this country, to their belief about what's inside them, to walking with the truth, and to taking care of business the right way. We truly believe that with the way we're doing this, 100% of the right people are coming on board with us, and so far it has proven out. It's how you connect with their heart, and you'll know when it's time to tell them to light the light in the darkness for them, to clear the fog for them. One word. Network. There always will be and only will be one number one network. Always. Some praise the Lord for it. Some will badmouth and curse and slander it. The world, I'm talking the real world here, has always been that way. We have been number one for over 50 years because we have what it takes to be number one. Now are we good enough and fast enough? strong enough and smart enough and have enough faith, conviction, loyalty, discipline, honor, and integrity to hang on to that, to stay number one for the next 50 years, the next seven generations, we're looking for a few good men and women. Do you know people like that? We don't accept applications, only commitments. Do you have what it takes? Well, let's talk about who we're looking for. We are looking for people in trouble. Now, people in trouble means people who already know which direction they're going with their own life, know what they want out of life, and know that because the big bad world is sending trouble their way. That's just the way the world works, so we made it work for us and not against us. People in trouble know they can't make it alone, and they want to be on the winning team no matter what the world throws at them. People in trouble know they're going the right direction, and they're looking for that something which they know will be loyal to them, and they can be loyal to it. People in trouble are bright lights in a world of darkness, and the darkness hates the light. So we have to put up with the nonsense which the darkness tries to throw on us. We're not looking for people who are addicted to the illusion of their own little safe haven, the mirage that their little bubble that bursts when trouble arrives, and then suddenly they're thirsty, but when they reach for the water, all they get is a handful of sand. This is not about the illusion, folks. It takes trouble coming to make people think straight. We're looking for people who think straight. We're looking for people whose minds are made up that it's time to take care of business. We're looking for people who can read between the lines and see the whole picture. We're looking for people who can stand up together in the face of challenges, even if their knees are knocking. People who know the game is to step out into the real world and see the need. The need for decisions that make sense in the world of nonsense. The need for remote control of your own finances and environments. The need for solutions to the devastation on our families and right living. The need for truth to conquer lies spewing out from the internet and media and government. The need for answers to big mouth, small minded, out of control freaks. The need for putting government in its place and taking care of business. We're looking for people who will rise up without objection before their life mission, grab a hold of the network way of taking care of business, and take off with it like a rocket. Now, today, the future and the vision of America is one word, network.